Adrian and Ida. Have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? I have. When Ida was a little girl, she would always play mummy and daddy's and hold the baby doll. Whilst she mothered the doll, she would pretend to have a husband. Adrian. Through your hard work and persistence, you have provided the best for your wife and your daughter, and you are truly the apple of her eye. I'm so proud of all you have achieved in life, and I believe that your future only can hold bigger and better things. These hurdles had led Adrian and Ida to this moment in their lives. A moment that I know Ida has dreamt and wished for since she was a little girl. Now Adrian, that's another story. He was probably dreaming about motorcycles and tattoos. proud moment to watch your daughter become a mother. Today to see Ida walk down the aisle, to marry Adrian, the man of her dream, is a milestone in both your lives. You're the first of the year, a warm kiss in the cold. You're the whisper in my ear, when I need it the most. If I was cast on an island, and could only bring one thing, still you'd be all I need all I need. Ida, it's hard to put words what you mean to me. From the first day you were in my arms, growing up into a beautiful princess, and now an established young adult, you will always be my little girl. Adrian, from when Ida introduced yourself to me, have gone from a shy person to a grown, to a young man and am proud to witness the growth in you over the years. Not many young men at your age would have taken huge responsibilities such as being a father, starting your own business from scratch and now a role of a husband. I know Ida is in good hands. the last five years, I've called you my future daughter-in-law. Now, with honour and pleasure, I call you my daughter-in-law and the mother of my granddaughter. You have been blessed having a family that has unconditionally loved and supported you throughout your journey. You're the wind in my sails, you're the pull of the sea, you're the wish in the well, and my faithful belief. If the whole wide world was offered to me, still you'd be all. I need Oh, you'd be all I need I, Adrian Take you, Ida, to be my wife. I, Ida, take you, Adrian, to be my husband. 
I promise to be faithful to you in the good times and bad. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honour you all the days of my life. I can describe Adrian and Ida is yin and yang. Adrian is the laid back, quiet, I can't put that together, whatever guy. Ida is the confident, talkative, I can do everything and still make you homemade gnocchi girl. But somehow it works and they are the perfect couple and the perfect mum and dad to Sienna. I wish you both a lifetime of happiness. May your every dream be realised by you both. As the saying goes, may today be better than yesterday and all of your tomorrows together be better than today. Cause you never feel this way. It's my lucky day. And lastly, to my husband, Adrian. Thank you for loving me, putting up with me, and pushing me to the boundaries that I never thought I could go beyond. Thank you for giving me Sienna and for being such an amazing dad to her. We all know how much she cherishes you, and to see that as a mum, it melts me. I hope you all enjoy this evening, and let's get the party started. Don't need a part of gold, a rabbit's foot to be I couldn't wait to grow up and be an adult. Always would say she wait to be married one day and for myself to walk her down the aisle. Well, we did that today. Don't 